Hello everyone we are discussing about the Rottweiler dog breed. Rottweiler is a breed of domestic dog, regarded as medium to large or large. The dogs were known in German as Rottweiler Metzgerhund, meaning Rottweil butcher's dogs, because their main use was to herd livestock and pull carts laden with butchered meat to market. This continued until the mid-19th century when railways replaced droving. Although still used to herd stock in many parts of the world, Rottweilers are now also used as search and rescue dogs, guard dogs, and police dogs. History Rottweiler Memorial in Rottweil According to the FCI standard, the Rottweiler is considered to be one of the oldest surviving dog breeds. Its origin goes back to Roman times. These dogs were kept as herder or driving dogs. They marched over the Alps with the Roman legions, protecting the humans and driving their cattle. In the region of Rottweil, these dogs met and mixed with the native dogs in a natural crossing. The main task of the Rottweiler now became the driving and guarding of the herds of cattle and the defense of their masters and their property. This breed acquired its name from the old free city of Rottweil and was known as the Rottweil Butcher's Dog. The butchers bred this type of dog purely for performance and usefulness. In due course, a first-rate watch and driving dog evolved which could also be used as a draft dog. The build-up to World War I saw a great demand for police dogs, which led to a revival of interest in the Rottweiler. During the First and Second World Wars, Rottweilers saw service in various roles, including as messenger, ambulance, draft, and guard dogs. The Deutsche Rottweiler Club DRK, German Rottweiler Club, the first Rottweiler club in Germany, was founded on 13 January 1914, and followed by the creation of the Suddeutsche Rottweiler Club SDRK, South German Rottweiler Club, on 27 April 1915 and eventually became the Earth International Rottweiler Club. The DRK counted around 500 Rottweilers, and the SDRK 3,000 Rottweilers. The goals of the two clubs were different. The DRK aimed to produce working dogs and did not emphasize the morphology of the Rottweiler. The various German Rottweiler clubs amalgamated to form the Allgemeiner Deutscher Rottweiler Club ADRK, General German Rottweiler Club, in 1921. This was officially recorded in the Register of Clubs and Associations at the District Court of Stuttgart on 27 January 1924. The ADRK is recognized worldwide as the home club of the Rottweiler. In 1931, the Rottweiler was officially recognized by the American Kennel Club. In 1936, Rottweilers were exhibited in Britain at Crux. In 1966, a separate register was opened for the breed. In fact, in the mid-1990s, the popularity of the Rottweiler reached an all-time high, as it was the most registered dog by the American Kennel Club. In 2017, the American Kennel Club ranked the Rottweiler as the 8th most popular purebred dog in the United States. Technical Description The Fédération Sinologique Internationale gives the following description of the Rottweiler standard. Rottweiler breeders aim at a dog of abundant strength, black coated with clearly defined rich tan markings, whose powerful appearance does not lack nobility and which is exceptionally well suited to being a companion, service, rescue and working dog. This breed is all about balance, endurance, proportionality, intelligence and strength. The various standards in place for the Rottweiler's physical appearance specify these characteristics. Anatomy of the Rottweiler 1. Head, eyes 2. Snout, teeth Tongue 3. Dewlap, throat Neck, skin 4. Shoulder 5. Elbow 6. Four feet. 7. Highest point of the rock 8. Legs, thighs and hips. 9. Hawk. 10. Hind feet. 11. Withers. 12. Stifle. 13. Hog. 14. Tail. Working style. A Rottweiler herding sheep. According to the American Kennel Club, Rottweilers have a natural gathering style with a strong desire to control. They generally show a loose eye and have a great amount of force while working well off the stock. They make much use of their ability to intimidate. The Rottweiler often carries the head on an even plane with the back, or carries the head up but with the neck and shoulders lowered. Some females lower the entire front end slightly when using their eyes. Males also do this when working far off the stock in an open field. This is rarely seen in males when working in confined spaces such as stock yards. 
The Rottweiler has a reasonably good natural balance, force barks when necessary, and when working cattle uses a very intimidating charge. There is a natural change in forcefulness when herding sheep. When working cattle, it may use its body and shoulders and for this reason should be used on horn stock with caution. The Rottweiler, when working cattle, searches out the dominant animal and challenges it. Upon proving its control over that animal it settles back and tends to its work. Some growers have found that Rottweilers are especially suited to move stubborn stock that simply ignore border collies, kelpies, and others. Rottweilers use their bodies to physically force the stubborn animal to do its bidding if necessary. When working with sheep, the Rottweiler shows a gathering, fetching style and reams directions easily. It drives sheep with ease. In some cases, Rottweilers have begun herding cattle without any experience at all. If worked on the same stock for any length of time, the Rottweiler tends to develop a bond with the stock and will become quite affectionate with them as long as they do as it directs. The Rottweiler is also exceptionally suited for and is commonly used in many dog sports including agility and shoots him. Temperament. A litter of seven Rottweiler puppies at three weeks old. In the breed standard published by Federación Sinologique Internacional in 2018, the Rottweiler's behavior temperament should be. The Rottweiler is good-natured, placid in basic disposition, very devoted, obedient, biddable and eager to work. His appearance is natural and rustic, his behavior self-assured, steady and fearless. He reacts to his surroundings with great alertness and at the same time even temper. In the American Kennel Clubs, official standard of the Rottweiler, the Rottweiler's temperament should be a calm, confident and courageous dog with a self-assured aloofness that does not lend itself to immediate and indiscriminate friendships. A Rottweiler is self-confident and responds quietly and with a wait-and-see attitude to influences in its environment. It has an inherent desire to protect home and family, and is an intelligent dog of extreme hardness and adaptability with a strong willingness to work making them especially suited as a companion, guardian and general all-purpose dog. According to the American Rottweiler Club, for us, Rottweilers are the best breed in the world, but we firmly believe they are not a dog for everyone. Rottweilers require a calm, stable and firm, pack leader, or they will assume that role for you. Puppies and adults need socialization, exercise and stimulating mental challenges. With these things, you will have a wonderful companion, Without them, your Rottweiler may become destructive and out of control. Rottweilers are a powerful breed with well-developed genetic herding and guarding instincts. Potentially dangerous behavior in Rottweilers usually results from irresponsible ownership, abuse, neglect, or lack of socialization and training. However, the exceptional strength of the Rottweiler is an additional risk factor not to be neglected. It is for this reason that breed experts declare that formal training and extensive socialization are essential for all Rottweilers. According to the AKC, Rottweilers love their owners and may behave in a clownish manner toward family and friends, but they are also protective of their territory and do not welcome strangers until properly introduced. Obedience training and socialization are required. One study published in 2008 found that male Rottweilers have higher confidence, sharpness, and defense and play drives than females. A 2008 study surveying breed club members found that while Rottweilers were average in aggressiveness, bites or bite attempts towards owners and other dogs, it indicated they tend to be more aggressive than average towards strangers. This aggression appears correlated with watchdog and territorial instincts. In the Rottweiler handbook, Joan H. Walker states that, the Rottweiler is very territorial, meaning that the owner will have to regularly work with the dog to control its territorial aggressiveness. Health. Rottweiler. Rottweilers are a relatively healthy, disease-free breed. As with most large breeds, hip dysplasia can be a problem. For this reason, the various Rottweiler breed clubs have had X-ray testing regimens in place for many years. Osteochondritis dissecans, a condition affecting the shoulder joints, can also be a problem due to the breed's rapid growth rate. A reputable breeder will have the hips and elbows of all breeding stock x-rayed and read by a recognized specialist, and will have the paperwork to prove it. They will also have certificates that their breeding animals do not have entropion or ectropion and that they have full and complete dentition with a scissor bite. As with any breed, hereditary conditions occur in some lines. The Rottweiler is very prone to osteosarcoma, 
which is among the most common causes of early death in Rottweilers. For unknown reasons, Rottweilers are more susceptible than other breeds to become infected with parvovirus, a highly contagious and deadly disease of puppies and young dogs. Citation needed. If overfed or under-exercised, Rottweilers are prone to obesity. Some of the consequences of obesity can be very serious, including arthritis, breathing difficulties, diabetes, heart failure, reproductive problems, skin disease, reduced resistance to disease and overheating caused by the thick jacket of fat under the skin. Breed surveys in the US, UK and Denmark, and UK vet data puts the average lifespan of Rottweilers at 8 to 10 years. As with the vast majority of large breed dogs, Rottweilers are also predisposed to dilated cardiomyopathy.